Ain't no way Adonis is dead, and I think it's been proven at the end of the last episode because that girl that was part of like the human side, you know, the building fell down. No one could see what was really going on behind. All we saw was the head getting cut off, but technically it was like a body dupe. And Adonis is probably transferred somewhere safe. So meaning she's a spy. And I guess the witches still have their spies in the human kingdom, which is really interesting. The king is slowly dying from, you know, being using that anti-magic tech actually kills people. Now, is the king actually dying from that? Or is the queen actually poisoning the king? And is the queen, some people are saying, she probably is super sus and she might be a witch herself. Does that mean she's on our side? I have no clue. And the funniest shit at the end of the last episode, that girl, remember? That girl, she had a boyfriend or she had a crush that she confessed to. Motherfucker got stopped in a building, but she ran away. Fair, I would've done the same, right? Like, I'm gonna prioritize my life. But at the end, she started looking pictures of Adonis in front of his grave. And he's like, damn, Adonis is so fucking hot. I'm like, bro, what the fuck? This is deranged. Anyways, let's begin today's reaction. Adonis? Adonis? Where are we? But these are all witches too. New waifus. Ophelia? Oh, damn, Granny got it going on. What the fuck? Hey, I mean, hey, would well, I mean? Hear me out, guys. Is it Granny giving him the suck? Yo, Granny's game is crazy, huh? Flashback? Wait, we're back in. But we were at the other place. But we're back to where we were. The the spy. The spy. Duplication magic. But, but what about Madame Ophelia and, and, and that I'm gonna call that the witch's paradise. What about that different realm? What what I I don't know anymore, man. We're back on Earth though, I guess. Anna. Is Anna the real girl? Like, Dorka's dead. Dorka got set up, but Dorka's just done now, and Anna's the actual main girl of the show. Are we getting transported? Bye bye. No one behind the building saw this? They could at least see the fucking ball going up. Okay, no, no, no. We're back to the witch's paradise. <laughs> Granny is gat! God damn! <laughs> Look at those! The most stacked granny in anime I've seen, but this is pretty much all witches, right? This is just a harem. We have a nation of witches. It exists. What? Duruka did say it though. Damn, bro's getting the royal treatment. Oh, he's so hot. Look. Oh, never mind. I thought they were gonna talk about Adonis. <laughs> Damn. Just all girls here, huh? I mean, there's no guy witches. Yeah. I'm sure he's gonna get along fine here then. They all love Chloe. Look at this. Yeah. Nice. But Doroka was probably the same too. I don't know. Doroka's just really dead. She's done. That's crazy, dude. Look at her. You can just get up from the chair. What do you mean? Let me tell. She, she was really just like revered as one of the best witches. That's her right there. Yeah. And there's gotta be a reason. That's the reason? Technically, it's Adonis' fault for that, but she still did it. Damn. Would he hate Ophelia for that? But they still saved Adonis at the end. Granny's gyat is going crazy, bro. Look at the fucking cape swirling to the side so you can see her gyat. So edgy, bro. Come on. His uh, feather quill. Pretty cool. Yeah. That's okay. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Dude, come on now. <laughs> Did he need to do that? I feel like she's not gonna give it back. It's okay, she is. Yeah. <laughs> that girl didn't need to get hit at all. What the fuck? <laughs> Move, bitch. <laughs> it turns into such a little soft oo baby when it comes to Chloe. Ophelia. And Madame Ophelia. Yes, with the memories of Chloe. Doroka did say that. Let's do it then. We need his memories. That Earth? Is that Earth? So the witch's paradise is just complete different world. Celestial object. Like 
Out in space. On the moon? Wait, wait, we're on the moon? Luna Media. Okay. The moon landing is real, guys. She doesn't need the the space gear, but he does. I, it's a witch, but I don't know. Tree that produces witches. Because obviously there's no guys here to impregnate the women. Do witches grow on trees? The witches actually grow on trees. Wow. Okay. Unisex is in both? No mating pairs. Yeah, that has just come from a tree. Last surviving tree, there used to be multiple trees. But if this one was burnt, then there'd be no more witches ever. Bald! 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 We're gonna regenerate Chloe with Mito, right? But is it gonna be that simple? Like, what about the revenge plot? Though? Are we really gonna DV from the revenge plot? I feel like it can't just happen this easily. Okay. Yeah, we can make huge bullets. We can do pretty much anything with it. So what about we think about resurrecting Chloe? Okay, memory. Chloe's memories. Then perhaps... But I just feel like it can't happen that simple. If Chloe resurrected, would he still be wanting the path of revenge? Maybe Chloe would be down to dunk on the king together? But something's gotta go down, right? There's gotta be more plot twists, because... The author can't just abandon the revenge plot. Like, if you... If the foundation of the show is a revenge story, and you bait people into the revenge story, but you don't deliver on it, people will drop. Anna. Oh, hey. Thank you? Oh, she's a little dumb. What? 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 Oh, I forgot about Doroka. <laughs> Doroka. <laughs> That's kind of what I'm saying, bro. <laughs> kind of true, kind of true. He's so base sometimes, but he's so mean. No, we are. Bye. 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 Yeah, it's because he's the main character. This is getting complicated. Huh. Use Chloe. Technically, their goal is to resurrect Chloe. Adonis is also just another tool. Planning to use Chloe. For what though? We need to flee the witch's nation? No, we need to fl we need to flee this means run away from the witch's nation. It's not about we need to go to the witch's nation, we need to run away from it? Yeah! It's only the humans that need it! Oh, wait, wait! Maybe we need to kill all the witches. Maybe we need to kill Granny. They need this. They need this fucking memory stuff. The plot is thickening. The plot is... And she's the only one that can make the quills too. They want to mass produce it. It's not because they love Chloe. Because they need Chloe to survive. Ho ho. Suddenly I don't feel so bad for Adana slapping that girl saying, Move, bitch. What do you want? What are we going to do? It's not like... It's not like he won't... You know... Like... Res like he's going to resurrect Chloe, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bald! 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 Hmm... Oh, look at his eyes! Yo! Revenge plot is still on the plate, boys. Oh, let's go. Look at these innocent looking witches dingles. Oh, look at me. It's just a paradise, but 
Hmm. A sinister plot is underneath all this. Oh. But what if Chloe rejects you guys? I don't think Chloe would be really down to be used like that, right? She, it's not really like her to do that? I don't know. I don't really know enough about her, but... She's straight up called nostalgic memories. All right. Now we implant these memories into that one bald girl, and then she'll become Chloe. Still bald. Still not Chloe yet. What do I see? Who kind of looks like her? Faruru looks like Chloe? Wait, that seems kind of important. Wow. That whole notion was very sus. Sure, sure. This is such a happy memory, but the soundtrack is so ominous. You gon' find a pair of panties. You gon' find a pair of panties. Where is it? Oh, oh, a little peek. Uh oh, uh oh. Hey, no peeking. Oh. What the fuck? Where did she get all those bruises and scars from? <laughs> I thought he just said, I'm just gonna go stand and watch you. <laughs> Why is she so beat up? Why? We need to learn more. What? Why? Does, does the bruises and the scars have something to do with it? Maybe it's just like the isolation of being cast out from the witch's paradise. So like having Adonis is something like she can depend on. Maybe I'm reading too deep into things. No more bald! Hair! Hair! Not bald! Not bald! Chloe's back. Okay! Catch her, catch her! Wait, that's Doruka. That's Doruka! Wait, it's not Chloe! Wait, 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 wait! What the fuck? Huh? Huh? But it was Chloe! Her hair was blonde! And then Doruka showed up! The blonde radiance turned to pink! What the fuck is Doruka here? I. 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 Technically, I guess we can resurrect Doruka like that too. Did he do this for Anna? Was this an... Or uh, another plot twist? I don't really know. But what I do know is, revenge is still on the plate. And the witches can get some too. And the granny, she got that gya butt. And you know, if she's actually that evil, they can all get these hands. But hey, if you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. Until next time, take care.